Hi guys, it's Empress Virgo of Empress Virgo. So we're back again with another reading. This time it is a general reading for the Earth Sign Collective, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placements. I hope you guys are staying healthy, happy, and safe out there. And I appreciate all the love and the support that you guys give to me and to the channel. It is much appreciated. So let's get into the Tarot. All right. So let's split the deck. We have the Nine of Pentacles and Justice. So things are being balanced out in your favor, okay? Just hold on. Okay. So, Divine Holy Spirit, what general messages do you have for the collective of signs, stars, Virgo, and Capricorn? Some on rising and Venus placements. As always, guys, with any tarot reading, only take the messages that apply to you. And let the rest fly. Meaning, if it doesn't resonate with you in your particular situation, don't make it see it. Just try to check one of your other prominent natal chart placements that you resonate the most with, okay? You might have a message there somewhere, okay? All right. So, let's get into it. Let's get into it. All right. Mm, okay. We're going to do a six-card spread. We have the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. So things are looking up. The Page of Swords. The Queen of Cups. The King of Pentacles. Yeah. <laughs> the Five of Swords. Ugh. We'll clarify if we need to. And the Strength card. Overall energy, Five of Pentacles. Right now, it's like you guys are wrapping up a cycle. You're frustrated. You're trying to figure out how to get out of this cycle, but you really don't know how to move forward for some of y'all it feels like y'all have been going through this for a minimum of five years okay five to seven years um with this frustration if it, it seems like you guys don't realize that you have the key to unlock your own problems there's a key right there available to you it's like i don't know if you guys can't really see it right now in regards to career finances or trying to find your way out of a particular rut that you've been in take it how it resonates for you but yeah if, if y'all got the key Y'all got a brilliant idea or something waiting for you to discover it, a path of money or an idea that will make you money or some type of uh, employment or whatever the case may be. But I feel like y'all don't really see it because it's kind of sort of in the shadows. If you look at this card on the Five of Pentacles, she has a head down here. She can take her resonance. And it seems like this person is very devastated about what has happened, whatever it may be in their lives. But it's like they're in the shadows right now. But there's a lit or a lighted path right there with a key. If y'all can't see right here. And there's the keyhole. You have the key to change anything that's going on in your life. I know it's hard to, to believe that. Because, hey, we all struggle with that. But you, whatever happened in your past or what it seems like is happening now is for your highest good, okay? interesting okay all right with the will of fortune like i said things are, are life didn't happen to you it was happening for you even though you might have been frustrated it's literally a roll of the dice the things that you were going through okay uh with the will of fortune but i feel like for a lot of you guys you really don't know how your luck is changing it feels like y'all have been researching something or trying to go back to school or trying to figure out how you can get yourself out of a rut Spirit is telling you to remain calm, stay still, keep calm, and carry on. I feel like a lot of y'all need to go within. This Queen of Cups represents Earth Sign Collective. Being emotionally balanced, open to receive whatever Spirit has in store for you, and going with the flow. That's the most important thing Spirit wants you to do is go with the flow, okay? Uh, with the King of Pentacles, once you learn to go with the flow, you'll open up and you'll be able to manifest uh, everything that you your heart's desire or whatever it is you're trying to do for yourself for some of y'all is trying to get that brilliant idea but you're all over the place you're all scattered for others of y'all it's being open to what spirit has for you and actually walking the path that is for you okay a lot of y'all with this five of swords you get this frustration because it seems like things are not coming but that's because certain things have to clear before things can get moving for you guys okay i feel like you're really frustrated you feel like okay what is this but if you look at the five of swords here the man that's sitting here he has crow on his shoulder and there's birds for a lot of y'all y'all might be seeing crows or any other type of black bird 
and right here it's like you've been through so much if you can see it's a trail of blood right there but right now you're on the top of right here in this particular version of you you're standing on top of a mountain having the victory it's a lot that you've been going through you've been frustrated you've had struggles whatever the case may be but you're going to come out on the other side of it very tough and very focused the strength card talks about receiving what is due to you yes overcoming trials and tribulations but all of those trials and tribulations have, has made a warrior out of you and you're seeing your way and you're getting your way you're digging your way out of whatever it is whatever circumstances you have been experiencing okay you're making your way forward you're almost there don't give up now jeez okay all righty so let's see bonus walk message for the collective earth signs let's see here i really hope this reading resonated with you guys if it did give the video a thumbs up okay all right let's see what we got here ah i do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness for a lot of y'all, you need to meditate, pray, chant, journal, but she has her eyes closed. He or she, whether you're feeling frustrated or not, these two cars, these two particular people, whatever you <laughs> resonate with, they have their eyes closed. They're getting that inner wisdom that they need to help them move forward and overcome obstacles and goals. I tell y'all all the time, if you didn't remember me telling you, I'm going to tell you now. Prayer is asking God, spirit, source, or whoever you choose to call on for help. Meditation is sitting still, calming your mind, calming your thoughts, and receiving those answers from spirit source. Spirit is telling you to tap in. Tapping in will help you to move forward or at least calm your anxiety, calm your nerves. We all can benefit from that, okay? Just saying, okay. And on the bottom of the deck, it says, hope is the conduit for miracles. Always stay hopeful. Always wear joy. And know that everything is working out in your favor. Okay, guys? All right. So that is all I have for the Collective Earth Signs for your monthly message. I hope you guys enjoyed the reading. If you did, give the video a thumbs up. Share, subscribe, join our tribe, hit the notification bell. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.